we will be creating graphics for Instagram Reels, specifically the Instagram Reels covers. I'm thinking the post will be something like five best cameras for vloggers. We're gonna take this photo, let's hit remove background, approve this cutout, ungroup this text and also move it out of the way. Let's do white, move this headshot in the middle. Let's edit the text for vloggers. So it's in front of me and then five best. Let's make it a little bigger. When you are uploading Instagram reels or like the reel cover, you can adjust the image preview on the feed and it's only going to show like the square dimension. When you go in and crop the photo or like when you adjust like what's going to be shown on your feed, make sure like no like words get cut off from your image. You'll be in the clear with Instagram's crop tool thing. Once this is done, we're gonna hit the resize button and then we're gonna go into story. Now you know <laughs> um, when you're on the feed, all of the words will be in place just like this. And then when people switch to the reels tab, it'll show the whole image like this. Let's just start with some shapes. And I'm thinking this will be like a recipe video, like how to make Korean fried chicken. Let's put in some stars, make them different sizes. This photo is looking a little dull. I kind of want to boost the color a little bit. So we're going to click this photo and then let's go to enhancements. Make some minor adjustments. We're going to add a little bit of brightness to it. A tiny bit of contrast. Boost the color maybe to 10. Let's add a little bit of highlight. Shadow. This photo is very warm already. So let's offset it by adding... A little bit of cool tones by making the notch on the warmth negative, maybe negative eight. And then for sharpening, let's do like 10. Next, we're going to add text. Someone is interested in your content on your Instagram feed or if they're looking through your Reels tab. I feel like having text on it will just make searching for what they need a lot easier. Add text, Korean fried chicken left justify it if you got a chance to look at font recommendations they're right here put it here and then let's add something fun adding effects so we're gonna add a drop shadow and i kind of want to add a rainbowy effect let's offset it 50 and then we're going to add an outline we're going to make the outline black the white stands out we're going to change this nude color let's make it orange and then now we're going to duplicate this text and then from there we're going to change the outline we're going to make like a rainbow drop shadow effect take the duplicated text take the main color let's make it like a, a blue for the outline we're going to make it that same blue color for the orange let's change this we put it behind just flip it right here from there we can just zoom in nudge it using the arrow keys we're just gonna move it over it looks so good oh my goodness to make it easier to work with we're just gonna group it earlier i mentioned that this photo is not 9 by 16 so when i hit this resize button it is not gonna be a clean photo if you want to do this method where you start from square so that you get the crop in the safety zones make sure that the photo that you use is already in the 9 by 16 format click on it it just fills out the entire canvas this is the crop it is a little bit zoomed in pop it right back out readjust the little sparkle thingies and i would say like the text since we put it in the bottom corner what's it called the original square i would say like the text itself we can use that as like a guideline generally you don't really want to move too far away from the area that you are in now all we have to do hit download png solid color we just hit that download button we hit PNG. We will name our projects and not put my project one. IG Real 2. Bye-bye.